Wouldn't it be fantastic if you become more persuasive almost overnight? Just imagine what that would be like if suddenly your boss said to you, you know, you do deserve that raise. Or your co-worker said, thanks for that fantastic idea, well presented. Or, better yet, your wife said, you know, honey, I think that northern Saskatchewan fishing trip is just the ticket for our holidays this year. <laughs> well, okay, it's possible. I'm getting a little carried away on that last one. But believe it or not, according to persuasion authorities like Dr. Robert Cialdini, who has written a couple of books on influence, it is possible for each and every one of you to become more persuasive almost overnight if you learn and apply some of his proven principles of persuasion. And they've been very, very well researched. One of them, for example, is a principle that each of you knows right now. You've used it many times in your life. That is the principle of reciprocity. And we all know what that means. It means that if somebody gives us something, we feel a slight obligation to give something back. In fact, the best negotiators on the planet use reciprocity. You've been sold cars and probably many other things in your life on the principle of reciprocity because even though we all know what it means, very few of us understand just how powerful that principle is. And here's one study that is noted in Seal Denny's book that actually speaks right to that. In a study that was done in a restaurant, they asked a control group of waiters and waitresses simply to give the bill at the end of the meal. But the study group of waiters and waitresses, they asked them, they said, we want you to give the bill and we also want you to give them a single mint. So when they did, they found that their tips for the group that gave the mint increased 3% more than the group that gave none at all. Well, it's true. You're not going to work your way through university with a 3% increase in tips. But then they, then they repeated that study. And they said, let's do it again. This time, give them two mints. And what did they find? They found that their tips increased 12% more than the group that gave no mints at all. But it gets better than that. They then said, OK, now we want to repeat this again. But this time, we want you to give them the mint, a single mint with a bill, turn and walk away, and then suddenly and unexpectedly turn around and say, hey, you know what? How are you doing? Are you nice people? Here's another mint. And then they walk away. Well, their tips increased by 23% more than the group that gave no mints at all. Reciprocity is a powerful persuasion technique.